Hi, I'm Reverend Allie Bierman, and I welcome you to our gathering of Metaphysical Ministry International. So metaphysical ministry is all about the fact that 99% of what goes on in the world is not detectable by our five senses. So developing your ability to see, hear, taste, touch, smell in a different dimension is going to enrich your life and you're going to get to experience all the things going on around you that you're missing right now. We start every week with a happy share. And a happy share is something for which you feel happy and grateful because it leaves you, not your partner, not your kids, not your parents, not your best friend, it leaves you feeling happy, calm, at peace. And my happy share this week is I had a device that it was delivered to me not working right. And because of that, it came apart. And for months, I couldn't figure out how to fix it. And then yesterday, the universe said, take it and do this. And I did. And I very easily fixed it, and now it works the way it was supposed to work. So I feel very happy and very grateful that that happened. Now what I want to share with you, I've been talking to you about spirit and all the different ways spirit shows up in your life. And I'm going to share a video. You're going to notice they look a little different, certainly have a different background, and sound a little different because... This was an episode that I experienced after talking with an acupuncturist who is also an oriental medicine doctor. So here you go. Enjoy it. Spirit. What's your spirit? How's your spirit? What does spirit mean to you? Is it your degree of happiness? Is it seeing how your life is blessed? What's your spirit? How are you doing now? Is your day going ho-hum? Or is it going wow? It's all up to you. How are you feeling? What you do? Moment to moment, day by day. Nobody else gets to have a say in your life. This is your life. You are in control. Listen to your spirit. Your spirit is your soul. It will never steer you wrong. Your spirit speaks through your heart, singing a song to carry you forward on your meandering path. It paves the way through moments of strife. It gives you all your answers. It shows you the way to make hay. Pay attention, listen to your gut, it's info, it's accurate for truth, it's really all you've got. Wake up, tune in, see the light that surrounds you, the wisdom profound through sight, touch, smell, and sound. Happiness will finally abound when you know your spirit, your spirit will raise your spirits when you know your spirit. Your spirit will raise your spirits. You may remember I was talking a few weeks ago with an acupuncturist and he asked me how my spirit was. And to me, spirit means soul. And I went in telling them about how I'm very connected to my spirit and I'm very in tune and the messages that are coming all day long, I tend to get most of them. And he was kind of smiling the whole time because I assume because he's a doctor of oriental medicine that he was talking down that path. Well, after I finished, he just smiled bigger and he said, no, I mean, how do you feel? Are you happy? Are you sad? Are you depressed? And I'm like, oh. So what I did here was I took the two different meanings of spirit. One meaning, how are your spirits today? Are you feeling low? Are you feeling ho-hum? Are you feeling high? And 
the spiritual, more metaphysical meaning of spirit, which is in fact your soul. Your soul is what speaks to you. You might call it your intuition. You might call it your gut. When you get a feeling, when you get a message and you don't know what it means, and you ask, what does that mean? Where is it coming from? You don't get an answer. That's your spirit talking to you. Because it is you, all your past lives, all your future lives, past, present, future knows everything about you will never, ever, ever give you anything but 100% accurate information. So pay attention. Learn how to get so in touch with your spirit that you get all the messages because they come in all kinds of ways. You might be driving down the street and see a billboard that has an answer to a question you've been wondering about. You might be flipping your radio stations and here comes just a snippet of a song and it's your answer. Maybe you're standing in line waiting to make a deposit at the bank and you overhear just a piece of a conversation or maybe somebody's standing someplace in the library and they're holding a book reading it and you catch the title of it and you realize, oh, maybe that book has my answers. It's things that look like coincidence, they're synchronicity because that's how your spirit works. It does the how to make your life rich and full. So how is your spirit? You see, when you're in touch and you're getting all this accurate information for you, you never make decisions that hurt you. That doesn't mean things won't go wrong in your life because sometimes, and you may likely have noticed, that when you're... Uh-oh. Oh! Okay, sorry about that. <laughs> I thought the computer went to sleep. You may have noticed in your life you do the most growing when something really painful happens for you because it forces you to wake up, pay attention, become someone you've never been, and do things you've never done to be able to get through the situation. So you can find me over at letsgetmetaphysical.com, the temporary home of Metaphysical Ministry International. And if you haven't done so already, go on over there and listen to the podcast, Let's Get Metaphysical, because it's all about seeing in your practical everyday life, seeing all the invisible stuff that you're now missing, but it's impacting you because it's happening in the other dimensions I spoke about earlier. I will see you here next week. And in the meantime, I wish you a wonderful week filled with many blessings.